According to the American Kennel Club, a Shih Tzu's front legs are straight and their hindquarters muscular. Neither should be too long or short. The standard head is large, round, and is set high with the face looking forward. The eyes are large and face the front. The neck and body are the most important and should not be exaggerated. But what would happen if we used Shih Tzus as fighting dogs? Today on Shih Tzu Versus, we see how many dogs it will take to bring down Santa Claus. During the Second World War, Indian soldiers used the Shih Tzu as an early warning system. The armies placed Shih Tzus all over the front yards of camps and knew that if the dogs stood up excited and happy, it meant the enemy was near. The program was stopped in 1943 when studies suggested that the warning system didn't work at night, during daytime naps, or when the dog simply didn't feel like getting up. But how many Shih Tzus would it take to take down Santa Claus. As always, we'll look at some pros and cons of the dog and his challenger. The Shih Tzu comes equipped with soft hair. He can easily see past his nose. The dog is an excellent slalomer. It does not drool. The dog is prone to several conditions and diseases, such as hip dysplasia, heart disease, Cancer, Asperger's. Santa Claus was born December 25, 1422, after Saint Nikolai and his wife Judy gave birth to a fully grown old man. After a brief stint as a communist leader, Santa was exiled to the North Pole, where he still plots his revenge to this day. The story of Santa has, in some version, made its way into every Western civilization, except the city of Boise, Idaho. Santa is known the world over for his ability to stay up all night. The spirit of Christmas would win any battle in the public eye. Santa comes equipped with his own elf henchman. He is a committed husband in a happy marriage. The man is only active one day per year. He is always fat, sometimes sweaty. COPD. Santa has type 2 diabetes. Now, for the first time, we can see exactly how many Shih Tzus it would take to bring down Santa. Coming down the chimney from your snowy roof, no one around except a single woof. With the sun not even close to rise, Santa is in for quite a surprise. A Shih Tzu comes down from the top floor, Santa smiles, for he loves to adore. But then comes another, and another one still. Something is wrong, and they bite him at will. He runs out the door with a crash and a thud. There, Santa falls straight into the mud. He seems to be doomed right from the start. The Shih Tzus all come to tear him apart. More and more come, maybe a dozen or more, while the family all gathers at the front door. The kids get to see them rip Santa to pieces, and they continue to do so until his life ceases. Twelve Shih Tzus was all it took to bring down the enigmatic Santa Claus. Christmas may not be coming this year because, as always, the Shih Tzu wins.